Haitians were protesting high fuel costs on Wednesday in Port-au-Prince as the Caribbean nation continues to go into a free fall as violence soars and the economy tumbles. Demonstrators blocked roads by burning tires and setting up other makeshift roadblocks. Police were called to the protest and fired tear gas to disperse the crowds. Fuel shortages and gasoline cost increases have prompted various public transportation to also hike their fares. The tumbling economy is part of the unraveling of the country that has been struggling since last year to control increased gang violence that has spread to a larger part of the capital. The latest eruption of bloodshed took place in Tassolail, a sprawling neighborhood of Port-au-Prince where dozens have been killed in the last five days. Jean Hislain Frederic, deputy mayor in Sassolail district of Port of Prince, said that the fighting erupted on Friday in a clash between members of two rival gangs, and that at least 50 people had died and more than 50 were wounded. Valencia Charles and her 11-month-old son are residents of Side Solil. She left her home and is waiting at the public park with a few belongings for things to calm down so that she can return to her home. Recent criminal gang activity has forced the various petroleum terminal in the South Solel borough to suspend operations.